Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we'll be playing some more Centro 4. In this video, we're going to be doing the mission Kimby Gams Gambit. Jeez, I can't speak. Whatever. Alright, so, um, this video, we'll be doing this mission and probably the one after. It depends how long this one is. And let's get into this glorious game. And, um, yeah. Let's, uh, start the first in the story. Also, I did get my rank up to level 50. And, um, I got some infinite ammo for my weapons. But everything except the shotgun is infinite, so um, yeah. Anyway, let's just get there and um, yeah. Leaving you just grabbing ready and let's go. Woo! Oh, um, my mistake. I'm not late to the briefing, am I? We haven't started yet. I'm waiting on Miller. Still feel bad about punching Matt in the face. He'll get over it. Or he'll kill me in my sleep. That's always a possibility too. Got whoa, whoa, guy, guys. Can we just get to murdering already? We got a problem. Now we're talking. What's up? The Zinn are coming. Here? That's probably why he said it's a problem. All right, let's take cover. We should be able to ambush them. Not so sure about that. Oh, hell, the Damn it. Watch out. What was that? They're probably trying to counteract your powers. So really? Can take it away, my superpowers. The hell did they find us? I don't know. Who we have cares? A mole? Let's just kill them. Hey, we gotta go. There's too many of them. There's a helicopter on a nearby roof. We can use it to get everyone to safety. Everybody, follow me. Matt and I will head out on our own. We what? Take care of your people. We'll catch up. Fine. Before we do anything, we need some breathing room. Let's take out those tanks. Spaceship overhead. Stay still. and I will hold him here. All right. Just get everyone else to safety, player. We got this. Whoa, why are we running? I'm down for some murder. Ben says he has a plan. Me too, we lose but, this um... heat and then Whatever the plan was, it went out the fucking window. We need to focus on surviving. But I want a murder thing. Fine, we'll do it later. Everybody in before I leave without you. And I will, so do not test me. Yo, Pierce and Ben are getting into that car. Let's cover it. On it. Is anyone counting these kills? <laughs> uh, no, but I am. Where to? Okay, um, hold on, I'm scanning. Scan fast. Spaceship! Yo, these Zen have some high tech shit. What's the awesome part? Oh, the Zen have all kinds of Oh my of god. That's a good way of taking them out, I guess. They even Bit have suicidal. murder bots. Murder bots? Uh, that's my kind of household of lines. Who doesn't want that? Just like Johnny taught me.
while you miss. We need to find a safe place for Pierce and Ben to go. We're not going to my place. I didn't think you could probably crack that down. Spontaneously Everybody catch on fire. On. Okay. Are you kidding me? I'm on Everyone this building. Okay? We walked away, right? Oh, of look, every building we could land on. Is this a pet store? A cat. Fuck! Of all the buildings in Steelport, we crash on. Jesus Super Christ! Ethical reality. Climax. Who names this shit? I don't know. Probably me. Where to now? Doesn't matter. Doesn't the thing just found us. Kenzie, find us a way out. On it. Uh oh. Uh oh. Kenzie, what? Uh oh. Boss. What the hell? The game is on. It started by itself. I can't shut it down. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome We're to on. a very special episode of Professor Genki's. Super ethical reality climax. This burden into my brain. Doors active and the doors are locked. Nobody gets out, including us. Until that is, the contestants crack up enough points to fill the murdometer. Shit, I'm down. Let's do this. <laughs> oh, Kenzie's recording this. Where's, uh, more of them? Look at all the contestants today! And all new targets as well! The Zen Empire have taken it upon themselves to face the challengers. Truly, a bold move on their part. You're not kidding. The Zen are the fiercest opponents in the universe, Bobby. Basically oh, really? Because I can take the them out pretty easily. Yes, indeed. Haha, <laughs> toasty. Hey, you there, sir. You get away. You must be shocked to see me. I'll stop that. Player doesn't give me a murder box. Only my lasers do. Oh my god, is that Ginky? Die, you man cat. Let's watch the master at work. Let's over Genki, here if I huh? shoot it. Yeah, he looks crazy. Amber's big stupid head. Boss, he's kind of helping us. Die, you fucking man cat. Bye, Good man cat. Good shot by the contestant. Genki's sure gonna feel that one. It takes a particularly skilled player to take on Professor Genki. Especially after facing the considerable might of the Zen Empire. Of which we are required to bestow the virtues. <laughs> and there you have it, folks. Genki is down. Down, but never out, Zach. So true, Bobby. So true. <laughs> oh, Kenzie's recording this. Is that all? Looks like it. Oh, my gosh. What, more of them? Let's get to the prize room. That was fun. They got more game. So where to? What does this you know, car do? I generally do? don't like getting involved with these things, but this is really exciting. Kenzie, focus. What do we do now? Ben's plan was to overload oh. the simulation. We can still it's do fire. that, but not if the Zen know our every move. But you can make sure they don't, right? Yes, but I need to get back to the ship so I can find a way to cut them off. Once that's done, it's just a matter of finding the weakest point in the simulation. Get us to a safe spot so we can get back to the real world. Johnny 
Aww. Okay, move faster, Timmy. We have a tank right there. Oh, no, never mind. The tank is gone. Never mind, that's English. Hey, Claire. Pierce and I are pulling out of the simulation. Meet you back on the ship. Where's that static yeah. coming from? And how did the Zen find us? I thought your hideout was safe, Kins. What the hell? Oh, crap, it's in yak. Okay, he's angry, I guess. No! Boss, you need to get back to the ship now. Shondi, what the fuck are you doing? They got Kinsey. Boss, the men are here. What? We were set up. I got out of the simulation. Pierce and King were out cold. The proximity alarm is screaming, and Asha Miller and the vice president are gone. They kidnapped Keith David and left us sleeping so we get picked up by Zinya. Too bad for them we're awake. What's the plan? You and Gaz secure the doors while I check on Kinsey. Okay. We'll get you back, Kinsey. Just hang on. You ready? Visitors. Visitors. We got more than visitors. Let's clear out the lower decks. We have to hold the room. Fuck that. I'm not waiting for them to come to me. So close. Look the right fielder. Oh. What the hell? Oh. We're moving. Why are we moving? Let's get to the bridge. Are we driving into the sun? Gotta check the monitors. No need. I have already analyzed our situation. Shit, I forgot Mr. Deix Ex Machina was even on the ship. A Zin transport has attached itself and is dragging us toward what I assume is certain doom. So what can we do about it? If I were you, I would deal with the strange heat signature by the cargo bay first. Cargo bay? Fuck! Let's go! Are they still shooting at the Come wall on. or something? Get off me! Sorry. Oh. Good to be the president! Is Kinsey okay? Everyone's fine. Is in grabbed me and Hey, Sid said something about heat signatures? One of them put a device on the wall. I'm not sure what it is. What wall? That's not a wall. We got bombs over here. Bombs? Yeah. And they're set to blow. You thinking what I'm thinking? You blow up their Shawnee, ship? Shawnee, go back to Probably Kenzie and the then. rest. Gat, let's go blow up a spaceship. You got a specific thing you want to blow up, but just shit in general. Kenzie, what's the weakest point in the Zen ship? Yo, boss. Kenzie's... Fuck! I... Look, we'll just find the biggest glowingest thing on the ship and stick the bombs to that. The biggest glowiest thing on These the ship. These sure do yep. make a good argument for murdering him. Oh, they're nothing compared to their leader. And I'm gonna enjoy every second of tearing Zinyak apart. Take your time, huh? That sounds like a plan. Get the chance? I'm gonna rip Zinyak's goddamn head off. And I will. Now, where do you think the Zin have Kinsey? I don't know. But when I find Matt and Asha, I'm gonna beat that information out of him. Um, Yo, we got some alien gun over here. Do it. Hell of a welcome back, huh, Johnny? Mm. Fuck, you were thinking I wanted to go to Hawaii or something? I live for this shit. Do I win?
Large red cylinder, huh? Big and glowy. Looks perfect. Perfect. Here you go. Gotta find something that looks important. I wonder why. Oh, this looks important. Let's blow it up. What was that? Oh, crap. These bombs are hotter than we thought. Let's get the fuck out of here. Zinyak, let's get out of here and find Kenzie. God damn it! What happened? MI6 fucked us. I knew it! Asha had it out for me since jump! She talked shit in Pakistan, she sucker punched me I can't believe Miller had me fooled. To think I actually apologized. He's probably been working this angle for a while. Hell, he might have even been the one who tipped off Zinyak about Johnny. Doubt it. Dante said that the lowest circle of hell was reserved for betrayers. But it's important to remember that it's the storyteller who decides who the hero is, not morality. But while philosophers will spend years debating the ethics of the Kinsey Gambit, the Saints had a less charitable view. Keith David is a dead man. And he is. Matt Miller. If it's not too much trouble, I need to better familiarize myself with how the simulation works. I figure if I watch the changes to the code take place when you do a few different tasks for me, I should get a stronger grasp on the workings of Zim programming. Fine, but I better get something out of this. Um. Okay. What? I already did all this stuff in the simulation. I don't know if we can still find you, David. My fellow Americans, I know firsthand what this war with the Zen has cost us. How many more need to die before we realize that the time has come for us to put aside our pride and focus not on division, but unity? Does Zinyak have a strong personality? Absolutely. But then again, so did the previous president. And you know what? When I look at the two of them, I see more similarities than differences. Both have proven leadership experience. Both maintain their composure in high-pressure situations. Both have a love of Jane Austen. But most importantly, both of them will not stop until they get what they want. For this war to end, we need to stop rattling sabers and realize that victory doesn't come from annihilating an enemy, but by making an enemy your friend. All of us are heroes in our own stories. The time has come for us to grow up and have perspective. Earth will have its salvation, but it will come on the back of humility, not violence. Cute speech. Where's the part where you talk about selling out humanity? Humanity? Does that mean the nine of us? Earth is gone because you provoked a madman. I trusted you, Keith. And I trusted you. The country trusted you. And look where that led us. So what, you're putting your faith in Zinyak? Giving up your free will to be ruler of some bullshit daydream? You don't get it. Zinyak said he can restore Earth. All I have to do is kill you. He's lying to you. Maybe, but there's billions of lives at stake. If he's telling the truth, what's one life for the greater good? You sound just like Julius. He was right. How is Julius right? He was basically a madman. Think this crap can stop me? You're wrong. I've been injured, sword. Whatever. I'll just go around you. 
Keep stop. All right, fine. Damn those things! How do they even get the tank balls through the doors? They can bend the simulation to their whim. They. I'm venting. Rhetorical question. Go. Didn't want an answer to it, Matt. I don't want to go up the stairs. Thank you. All right. Well, you get in there. supposed to do with a naughty little boy like you? Ah. Enjoy your requiem, Mr. Dave. <laughs> I really hate that smug I? alien prick. Matt, you there? Matt? Matt? Damn it. The hell? You gotta snap out of it! Snap out of it! Ah! Look, you crazy mother! Hey! Stay away from me! What's that in the background? Keith! You know better! I'm telling you, you dumb son of a bitch! I'm trying to save your life! You couldn't even save your own! Keith! Listen to me! I'm giving you a choice! Get away from me! What? Let him go! They have him back. Hey, I'm Roddy. Roddy Pipe. Hey. I'm the President of the United States. Sure. Why not? Well, Prez, we got visitors. So much for a hard fight. That was easy. He sold out someone very important to me. Whatever trance he's in, I need him snapped out of it. He's going crazy. He thinks we're all out to kill him. Anything happens to Kinsey, and I will be. What is this place? A television broadcasting tower. What the hell's he gonna do with a broadcast tower? He's a crazy man with a microphone. What do you think he's gonna do? Ladies and gentlemen of America, the threat is right in front of us. An alien presence has taken- Got it all wrong, Keith. Zinyak's in your head. He's got you all confused. Keith, listen to me. The Zinyak guy is bad fucking news. You! I told you to get away! Get the fuck away from me! Something You're not gonna kill me, motherfuckers! It. Shit! I thought there was. Shoot. He's headed for the roof. I can see that. Soon, Crap. the whole world will the truth. The satellites, what's controlled? There's a lot of them. You take care of it. I'll handle it. I'll take out the CIDs. The what? Never mind. I got this. Shields down. All right, anyone else want to go? Any takers? All right, good. That'd be sign your death sentence right there. 
Give me them wires right now. Satellites down, did it work? No, the brainwashing is too ingrained. I'll have to beat it out of them. If Do you it. want to know where your friend is, now's the time to ask. Where is Kenzie, Keith? Where did Sinyak put Kenzie? Tell me, Keith! She's... She's... She's in... Keith, I think you got some unresolved issues. You don't you know think? Happened, kid. Now come on, we've got to save Kinsey. Wish we could call Roddy for help. No one calls Roddy for help. He shows up where he's needed most. Let's go. So he's a superhero, basically. He lives. Okay, then. Alright, guys, I'm gonna end the video here. Um, next video, we'll go and do a mission where we save Kinsey. So if you enjoyed, just leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you all next time. And goodbye.